Hey, it's Tim here. I'm literally just back from the gym where I learned an important life lesson. I talk a lot about being consistent and how you can achieve great things when you're consistent. I've not always taken my own advice and today I got an important reminder of that. See, I've not been the most consistent at going to the gym over the past year. I got great results with my fitness and then I started to slack off. It started with, you know, I'll, I'll start exercising more on my own without needing to go to the gym. I'll do push-ups at home and stuff like that. And of course, my consistency started to suffer. I've got just gotten back into that gym routine and I've started to meet some people at the gym that I haven't seen over the period of a year. I met um, one of these old chaps today. He's just made such amazing progress. I mean, he was like this big overweight guy and he's just been consistent, you know, putting in the hard work and he's got the most amazing um, body now. He's just lost like easily 20 or 30 pounds of fat. You know, he's put on a lot of lean muscle. You know, he just looks amazing. His health has just taken leaps. Um, to, to the next level. There was this other lady there who she, she's lost so much weight, really toned up over the last year as well. And you know, speaking to the two of them, it's really just about being consistent. They kept to their routine, they put in the work, and now they're getting the results. I've often said in an online business, just, just putting in consistent hard work is the best way to get results. And that's true for all areas of life. You can't expect to do bursts of work and see some amazing results just because of doing a few days of really hard work. Just can't, doesn't, it doesn't work that way. Put in small bits of work, manageable, manageable bits of work over a period of time. Pace yourself out. Anything worth achieving is worth treating like a marathon. Do the work, be consistent, and have a routine. If you're committing half an hour a day to whatever you're doing, then put in, make, make sure you do in that half an hour things you like as well as things that you don't like. Map out what you need to get the success that you want. Let's say you need to do five things, then do those five things every day. Like using the gym as an example again, we have, I, I like, um, doing upper body exercises. I'm, I'm good at that, so I'll keep doing upper body exercises, but that's not gonna get me all around fitness. I need to do cardio as well, right? Which I hate doing. You need to break that down. You need to break your consistent work down into the things you like and the things you don't like. Make sure you do all of those things and do them consistently. That way, I'm sure you'll get fantastic results. I mean, it's a formula that's worked for me. It's a formula that I've seen worked for a lot of people and I just got an important reminder of that today. So I hope that helped you and I'll see you next time.